because that is apparent, what I believe it to be if it's causing those things to disappear. I mean, I suppose we can know for sure by zapping myself with it and seeing what happens, but I've already wasted enough charges on it. A good emergency tool, though, even if it's all it is is invisibility, that might save my life at some point. What is this? A sprig of wolfbane. Cool. Pick that up. We can technically eat it as food, but... Um, yeah, okay, let's go down a level, and then come right back up. Leave my cat down there for now. It'll be fine. But what you really use it for is if you've been bitten by a werewolf, or a were-rat, or something like that. It'll cure you from lycanthropy. Shove a boulder a little bit. Mm-hmm. Lots of boulders here. Gold. What is that, an egg? Cool, let's pick up the egg. Now, we've got to be careful not to eat it accidentally, because it could be a very, very bad egg. I mean, it could just be spoiled, which would be bad. Get food poisoning and die. But it could be... What is that? Wolves? A couple of wolves? Yeah. Line yourselves up for me. Yes, and then I'll zap you both. Before you kill me. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, I'm now stuck in a corner, surrounded by wolves, who are kicking my ass. What can we do? I could drink my potion of invisibility. I do have a potion of healing. Okay. I'll zap another couple of times. And if I need to, I'll drink a potion of healing. <sighs> okay, killed one. Killed the other. Thank God. Wow. And we can probably eat these wolves. Gorge ourselves on that. We're not even satiated. So you were definitely on the verge of hunger again. You gotta be a little careful. My health's a little bit low. It's about half. Another shop. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. It's good to know. Okay, where do we go here? Do, do, do. Where are you? Dead end? Okay, that's not helpful. Hmm. That elk through here, was this a dead end? Iguana. Die, Iguana. Die. Hmm. It's probably in here, but I don't know. That's probably just a closet. Slightly deeper closet, but yeah. Hmm. I'm still wigged out by this area here. Oh, really nothing. Keep searching it and there's... Gnome Lord. Die, Gnome. Die. Okay, I'll zap you. There you go. Several objects here. Oh, you picked up all my shit! I already know what it is, too, because... That's funny. That is the problem with letting stuff l lie around. You do run the risk of something picking it up and trying to use it against you. random door here. Where's the Dwarf Lord? There he is. Bam. Seven. Broadsword, axe, cloak, shoes, mithril clo coat. That's awesome. I'm slowed slightly, but let's go and identify this stuff here. Drop all this stuff, because I don't know what it is. And I don't want to do the gems. Blessed pair of shoes. Blessed mithril coat and round shield. Mithril coat's very, very heavy, though. 
Oh, uncursed scroll of create monster. Awesome. Oh, I know what the scroll of create monster is because I saw someone use it against me. Hmm. Except. Okay. Um, take off my cloak. Wear the mithril armor. Yeah. So I can't actually use it because look at my spell failure. It's gone up by like 40%. So that's no good. Um, but it's nice and it looks a plus one dwarvish mithril coat. Probably worth a ton. It's where it gives you seven AC. Oh man. Maybe I should have played like a, a melee character. Um, what else can I put on that I don't know? The cloak. Hard shoes. Take off the cloak. Take off the boots. Oh, actually, they're plus two hard shoes? Wow, so they're a little heavier, but they're dropping my C by four. Awesome. Does it affect my spell casting? No. So good. Much better than the walking shoes. So let's put on that. And we're gonna have to drop uh we're gonna have to drop that mithril coat. It's just too heavy. And the shield. I suppose the shield is enough for now. Um I don't think I can use the shield with the staff. Can I? Let's wield uh, the Blessed Dagger, and then can we wear the shield? Is that how it works? Bam. And now, can I zap spells? Ooh, 70% failure chance. Okay, no, 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 no. Take off, take off the shield. Drop the shield. And wield my quarterstaff again. Okay, that's good enough. Let's just go downstairs. Go see my kitty. Hello, kitty. What do we got here? A tin opener. Awesome. Oh, and I should write down that uh, dungeon level 7, dungeon level, or dungeon level 6, has a neutral altar. Because I may run up again and identify some of that stuff later on. Or I guess i got to come up again for the uh, the dwarven mine at some point, no matter what. Grab a longsword. Now nah, I'm slowed. Okay. As much as I really... Really, yeah. Let me go upstairs and I'll drop the mithril coat there. Oh, at least I don't have to worry about anyone using it against me. On this level. Or on the level that I'm working on. Oops. Dingo! Ooh, doing a lot of damage. Ouch. And the wand of slow monster. And this is a zombie. An orc zombie. Now... The orc zombies, any zombies will also leave corpses from time to time, right? So you'll just come over and be like, oh, it's an orc corpse. Well, I've eaten orc corpses before, and surely that's fine. No, no, never eat undead meat. It will kill you. Like, 100% chance. What is this? A pony! Wow. Okay. And he's fucking hitting me. They do a lot of damage, too. God, no, fuck off! One, two, three, Aw, poor, five, poor pony. Seven, I'm not going to eat him, because I think that pisses people off. But I'm going to take his fortune cookies. Nidalee's going to eat the horse. Okay. You go, Nidalee, my little kitten. She might be a cat by now, I'm not sure. I'm now hungry, so let's, uh... Hopefully the fortune cookies aren't cursed. Nom nom nom. Affairs with nymphs are often very expensive. Yes, I know. So, let us loot the box. It's not even locked. It's got a gem in it. Awesome. I feel wise. I've been a very observant. Excellent. Uh, not observant enough to see that trap. Apparently it's a slowing trap. It's an anti-magic field. Huh. How odd. Oops. What is that? A bear? A jaguar. Oh, okay. Bad art. Oh, he's kicking my ass. Whew. And the eats the corpse. That that's totally cannibalism. Come on. Oh, I, th I think she's fighting something hungry again. Yeah, those fortune cookies. Just like Chinese food, man. You get hungry again super fast. May as well eat the other one. This one say they say that shopkeepers often have large amounts of money in their purses. I'm sure that's true. Sneak down, sneak back up. We got a lot of this floor left to explore, so I don't want to leave it quite yet. Is this another dingo? Jackal. Bam. Spell missed. There we go. 
Actually, I should check that wall. Dart. Apparently hit a dart trap, and I'm hungry again. Okay, so I guess, you know, let's um, apply my tin opener. Oh, you wield it. Wield. What? Really? Wield, star. I've never actually used the tin opener before. Can opener. Where is it? Here we go. Watch, this is going to be cursed and it's going to be stuck in my hand. Okay, so then I eat the tin and I should open it much faster. Normally it takes very long. It smells like sewer rats. You want to eat it? Sure, that sounds fine. Consume the dried sewer rat. And wield my quarterstaff again, because I don't think a tin opener makes a very good weapon. Leather golem? Really? Oh, he does a lot of damage. Nuke him. Nuke him. There we go. And he drops a bunch of leather armor, which weighs a lot. Now I can actually wield... I can wear leather armor without affecting my spells, I believe. But it's just too heavy at 150 weight each. Just nuking, nuking these jackals, one-shotting them. Jackal corpse. I'm going to eat that. There's another one over here. Bam. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's this? A fox. Die, fox. I see a whistle. Okay, I'll pick up the whistle. Oh, what's this? A leash! Oh, cool! I could actually leash my cat, and then it would uh, have to stay near me all the time. May as well do that. Apply... Uh, oops. There. Slip the leash around her, so she's got to stay within two squares. Just gotta be careful not to get her stuck anywhere. Because then you're pulling on the leash. Some more gems. Now, the curious thing to say about gems is that it's stacked together. Okay, yeah. Although, see, this green gem is not in the same stack as these green gems. They are different from one another. These might be two pieces of cut glass, whereas this might be an emerald. It's a little trick you can use. Anything you have a lot of, like, okay.